In this video, I will teach you step by step how to create a customer support help disk ticketing system website. We can support customers by publishing articles. Or we can publish answers to various questions from customers. Customers can also search for answers to their various queries. Customers can receive our direct support by registering on the website. Customers can get support directly from us by submitting a support ticket. Customers can get direct support from us by submitting their queries here. We are getting powerful admin panel to control this support ticket website. We can answer all ticket queries of customers through admin panel. Also, you get many functionalities in admin panel support ticket section. We can control all the functionality and features of the website through the admin panel. Also, you can change the website design step by step. In this video, I will discuss with you step by step how to customize the features and functionalities of admin panel. Now we will learn step by step how to create this ticket support system website. Now we need to purchase the source code to create the customer support help disk ticketing system website. Check the video description because I will provide the discount link of the source code in the video description. Then we have to click on the buy now button. We can download the source code from Code Canyon website. For this we need to purchase the premium source code from Code Canyon website. If you buy the source code once then you can use it on the website for lifetime. Also you get source code update version for lifetime and you can take developer support for any problem. We will also support you. If you have any problem installing the source code or any problem in customizing the website then you can contact us. You will find all the information to contact us in the video description. Now we will learn how to purchase source code from Code Canyon. For this we need to click on the add to cart button. Then go to checkout. Now we need to create an Vato account. We can easily create account using Google, Apple and Facebook. Or we can create account by submitting correct information here. I have already created account on Envato so I will log in account now. We must submit the billing details. We can purchase source code using three international payment gateways. You can pay by banking card or pay by PayPal and pay by Skrill. For example, I will now pay by bank card. For this we need to submit correct banking card information here. Then we will confirm the payment by clicking on this button. Wow, our payment is complete. Now we will go to download section. Then we have to click on the download button. Wow, now we can download all information of source code step by step. As you can see, I have already downloaded all the source code information. Now we will purchase domain hosting to publish customer support help disk ticketing system website online. You can purchase high quality domain hosting from Hostinger at low cost. Check the video description because I will provide the discount link of the Hostinger website in the video description. If you buy domain hosting from Hostinger, you will get many benefits. I have been using Hostinger domain hosting for my personal website for over 6 years. Because their domain hosting service is very high quality. Now we will learn how to purchase web hosting. You definitely get a free domain with these packages. Also you get many more features with these packages. You get 30 days money back guarantee with every package. If you don't like your domain hosting within 30 days, you can get your dollars back. Also, you can get 24 hours technical support from Hostinger. Or you can get direct support from us. You will find all our contact information in the video description. 
you can purchase any package as per your choice from here without any problem. As an example, I would now purchase the business web hosting package. We must purchase this package for 12 months. Now we need to create hosting our account. We can easily create accounts through Google. Wow, we are getting 69% discount. We have to pay a total of $59.88. We can make payment through bank card very easily. For this, we need to submit the correct information of the banking card here. Then we will confirm the payment by clicking this button. Also, if you have a PayPal account, then you can pay through PayPal. And you can also pay using other international payment gateways. Or we can also make payments through different types of cryptocurrencies. This way you can easily buy high quality domain hosting at low cost. After purchasing domain hosting, you will get a dashboard just like this. Now we will change the PHP version of the hosting panel. We will select PHP 8.1 version as per source code documentation. Then we will go to the file manager to upload the source code. Now we will go to public HTML folder. Then we need to extract the source code zip file. Then we will upload the zip file to the hosting panel. Our zip file is upload complete. Now we will extract the zip file. We need to choose a folder name. Now we will delete the zip file. Then we need to select all these files. Now we need to submit these files to the public HTML folder. Now we will delete this folder. Now we will search by typing our domain into the browser. Now we need to connect the database to the website. For this we need to go to the hosting panel. Now I will teach you step by step how to create database in hosting panel. And I will teach you how to add hosting panel database to website. For this you have to follow this video completely. Now we have to click on continue button. Now we need to submit the admin login information of the website. Now we have to click on continue button. Now click on the install button. Our source code install complete now our website is completely ready. So now let's log in to the admin panel. Now you can see the admin area of the website. Through this admin panel you can control all the features and functionality of the website step by step. Also, if you click on the profile icon, you will get many more features. You can see the ticket support request lists of customers. And you can create autons of blog articles for customers. We can create new multiple categories as per our requirement. And we can create unlimited multiple tags. Then we can publish question answer articles for customers. For this we have to submit step by step question answer article here. Now we will learn step by step how to customize admin panel. Now we will customize the appearance section. Then we will customize the general settings section. 
In this section, we can change the logo and favicon of the website. Then we can change the site name and website description. Also, we can customize the theme section of the website step by step. You can change theme section colors step by step. And you can change all kinds of features functionalities in theme section. We can customize and edit website menus. As we can edit and delete default menus. We can create multiple new menu bars. We are getting a lot of functionality to create menus. We can easily change and customize the home page of the website. We can change the background image of the home page of the website. Also, we can change all the texts on the home page. For this, you need to add new text on home page here. We can customize the ticket page of our website step by step. For example, we can change the text in the ticket support page section step by step. For this, you need to change the steps here in ticket support section. We can add custom code of our choice to the website. Then we can customize the SEO section of our website step by step. Here you can submit step by step search engine optimization information. Now I will discuss with you the important settings of the website. In this section, we get many important functionalities to control the admin panel. You can select the default home page section of the website. Also, we can select the default theme. We can easily generate sitemap on the website. Then we can see the sitemaps by clicking on this link. And we can add this URL to Google Search Console. We are getting many features to customize the Help Center section. Customize these important features according to your needs. We can also add real-time notifications to the website. We are getting some companies to add real-time notifications. Also, we can give ticketing system functionality step-by-step -step permission. We can easily customize the search section. Then we can customize the localization section. We can easily customize the authentication section. We can easily disable registration. Or we can grant login permission for only one device. We can also integrate many companies' social media login systems. We can control the uploading section of the website. We can add storage for uploads from other companies. Here you can see many companies. You can customize the uploading section step by step as per your requirement. Now we need to set up the mail server. Here we need to change the from mail address. Now we will rename the mail from. We can add many companies mail servers to the website. But we will use SMTP mail server for free. Now we need to go to hosting panel to add SMTP mail server. Now I will teach you step by step how to create mail server in hosting panel. Then I will teach you how to add the mail server information of the hosting panel to the website. For this you have to follow this video completely. We have successfully set up SMTP mail server on our website. We can easily clear all cookies on the website. Now we will go to the analytics section. In this section, we get the option to add Google Analytics. Also, we can see all the login information of the website. 
For this we need to use the secret key of sentry.io website. We are getting a lot of functionality to set up queues on the website. Now we will add Google Capture website to our website for security. Now I will teach you step by step how to add Google Capture to website. For this you have to follow this video completely. We can also customize the GDPR section. You get many features to customize the GDPR section. We can easily share the post in the trigger section. Here we are getting many features step by step to share triggers post. We can create multiple ticket categories. For this we have to submit the ticket category information here. Then we can see all the canned replies lists. And we can submit reply. We can control all users of the website. We can edit each user's account. We are getting a lot of functionality for user account control. Also we can easily create new user account. For this we have to submit information of new users step by step. We can easily create specific user roles. For this we need to submit user role permissions here. We can create multiple pages for the website. For this we have to submit the correct information of the page here. We can see all the tag lists on the website. We can create new tags. Also we can see all the files list on the website. We can add multiple languages to the website. For this we can submit language information here. Then we can easily translate the languages. In this video I have discussed important features of website admin panel. In this video I teach you step by step how to create a customer ticket support website. If you have any questions about this video then comment. Or contact us directly via WhatsApp and email. Thank you so much watching this full video. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.